Hey there, you guys. It's Jamie Porter here, and we are excited. We're going to join our number three, Pink, uh, Pink Boot Camp number three. This session is going to cover the skincare party, the skincare appointment, um, specifically the first skincare appointment. And so we're going to kind of go over the mechanics. So obviously the best way to really learn how to do a skincare party and to learn the things that you don't know are to observe them. So I know locally we do, we do the skincare appointment at the studio, but also I have my own parties. Your recruiter will have parties or facials. It's the exact same appointment. Believe it or not, the exact same appointment, whether it's one person in front of you or six people in front of you, it's the same appointment. So my purpose for tonight with you all is to go over the kind of the psychology and the, um, the, what we're doing when we do an appointment and um, the behind the scenes kind of stuff to help set you up for really successful um, appointments. And then at the end of this, part of your homework is gonna be to watch National Sales Director Kristen Sharp's um, party, party and Pass It On video. It was when she debuted as a National Sales Director and also did million dollar, her unit did million dollar sales club that year. And, um, and she held, I don't know what it was, 300 and something personal skincare parties. And so um, I want you to understand the power of the party. And that was the facial and the double facial, but the magic is in the party. And so it's a skill. Straight up, it's a skill. Sometimes we book the person and then we turn it into a party. Sometimes we have people that immediately just are party people and they want to have the party right out of the gate. And so either way, just know this, it's a skill. This is not something that is hard. It is something that you learn. So um, you know, I remember the first time I was a server, you know, I was, I was nervous. I was overwhelmed. Anytime I've started any job, I've always been nervous and overwhelmed because I want to do a good job and you have all this stuff to learn. Right. And so this is no different than any other job you've ever had, except that the one big difference is, is you're the boss. You're going to make all the money. You are being paid for yourself. You don't have to, um, you, you don't have a ceiling. You don't have to wait for somebody to die to be promoted. It's all on you and you can rock and roll. And I want, there's freedom in that. So get excited about that. All right. So the first thing I want to tell y'all is how many of y'all you can, I've got, I can see you. So just raise your hand. If you like shopping at Walmart, let's wait. I mean, if you had all the money in the world, you were a gajillionaire. Would you want to go shopping at Walmart or would you want to go shopping at like Neiman Marcus? Raise your hand if you want to do Walmart. Name of Marcus? Okay. Yeah. Okay. So how many of y'all want to shop at Neiman Marcus, but you want Walmart prices? That's like, like the best of all worlds, right? Doesn't matter how much money you have. That'd be really cool to go shop at Neiman Marcus, but have Walmart prices. Okay. So Mary Kay, I wouldn't say we're Walmart prices um, because it's a super quality product, but I would say that we're not Neiman Marcus, Marcus prices, right? But when you are having a skincare appointment with people, you want them to feel like they're in Neiman Marcus. You want them to feel like this is a super rich, awesome experience. Does that make sense? And so it's so easy to make something look beautiful and that they're important. You know, um, back in the, the greatest generation, my dad's generation, and even when I was a little girl, um, even when I was a teenager, you know, when we would go to church, we always dressed up to go to church. Um, and, you know, there's, 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 the important part is to go to church, right? It's like, if you're, it's not so much what you're wearing, it's just to go to church, but everybody's so casual. Like, let me give you a different example. Airplanes. When we used to ride on an airplane, everybody got dressed in their, in their Sunday finest to go on an airplane. Nowadays, you know, it's good if you can not see a butt crack on somebody. I can't believe I'm recording this, but that's true. Like, you know, the pants and the, the you know, people's toes hanging out because they just get comfortable. They got their sweat pants, like basically their pajamas. And you know what I mean? Everything's different, right? But, but don't you feel good when you're sitting next to somebody who's dressed nice, um, you know, and it's, it's a nice experience. If you go on a date and you get dressed up, you know, you're showing the other person that they're important and you know, you're excited about this and you care about them because you're presenting yourself that way. Does that make sense? So you wanna do the same thing with your appointments and you want it to be a system, okay? Because systems 
take emotion out of things. And we are emotional beings. Women are emotional. And you cannot decide to have a great party because you're in a happy mood. And when you're in a bad mood, you throw some schlumpy thing together. And, and, and sorry, people, but I'm not in a good mood. you got to have a system so it doesn't matter if you're high or low. It just rolls. You just roll with it because I can promise you this. When you have a party, you always get in a better mood because you're helping other people feel better. It's just happy. So I'm going through a lot of this, but I want you to understand this is really important. Super simple systems. Now, I'm not going to go into any more of this with you because I actually have a Facebook Live that I want you to go back and find in our Facebook Wave group. Um, there's a video that I did on this. I've done several, actually. Whenever I'm waiting for some clients to come in, I'll, I'll do like a little uh, video on my presentation when I have it all set up so you guys can see that. So I've gotten like things from the dollar store or whatever. You can make it look super pretty and super great and really easy, and it's all part of your, your starter kit bag, you know, stuff that you take on, and you don't have to do anything else. It's just a thing that you do every single time. Okay, so presentation. Watch the Facebook um, Live video. Okay, so the things that we're going to demo, now I'm talking to new consultants right now, okay, and so in your starter kit came the Miracle Set, both formulas, and again, we also have a video, I'm going to tell you to, I would go and watch the one that we talked about, packing your skincare, your starter bag, um, and so in my roll-up bag, I probably should show you my roll-up bag, I will show you my roll-up bag, so just don't judge me on my office. Okay, I know I was just with Rachel and we were setting up hers. Now, I had mine monogrammed because I just did. But this is my roll-up bag. This is my demo roll-up bag. Notice that there's no slimy stuff anywhere, that it looks nice. It's very clean, okay? Nothing is, like, getting spilled inside or anything like that. So in this top pouch, I have both sets of the TimeWise 3D, okay? That's all I have in here. Both formulas and the eye cream in here. Top pouch, 3D. My second pouch is the Timelines Repair. Now, if you're brand new and you haven't ordered product yet, you may not have this. But when you do order product and you start getting your free product, you want to get a set of this so that you can demo this. Because I will tell you, the Timelines Repair set, which is what I use, um, the reorder business on this is magical because the one moisturizer is $52, the other one's $52, the, the magic sauce in this set is $70. So when people reorder, it's almost always at least $100. But guess what? It works, and so you definitely want to demo this. This is something, it doesn't have to be for old ladies, okay? I know some of y'all might think I'm old, but I'm not old. Okay, I'm not old. Even the, even the skin um, app says that I should use 3D, but I use this. I think that's why it says I should use 3D. It works really well. So... That's the 3D or the um, repair. So my next, the third one down, this is the supplement bag. Okay, so this is what you want to write down. In this bag, the only thing that actually comes in your starter kit is the, is the oil for eye makeup remover. Okay, but in this bag, you want to have these demos. So if you, if you ordered your product, you got your first order in, and you got at least a 600 where you got a free bundle, usually the bundle I tell you to get I not tell you, I suggest that you get the first bundle, if you only can get one, is that um, open for business bundle. It's fantastic because every single thing in there, we demo in our first appointment. Okay, so that open for business bundle, it has your satin handset, which you already have in your starter kit, so you can actually sell that one. Um, it has the oil for eye makeup remover, which also already comes in your starter kit, so you can actually sell that one. But it also has your microdermabrasion, which is in here. It also has your charcoal mask, which is in here. That's two of the three spa treatments that they get to pick. Okay, they get to pick one spa treatment. So you've got two out of the three that we actually rep, um, you know, offer in our first appointment. Um, and then the other one is the facial peel, which is something that you can order as part of your 600 or, or higher, okay, is the facial peel. And you wanna demo these, because what happens is when you demo these, you sell these. The more things that, let me for that. This is all we demo in our first appointment, but the things that you demo are the things that people buy, okay? So the other thing that I have in this particular pouch is the foundation primer. This actually does not come in your, in your I don't think this comes in any of the bundles either. I'm, I'm trying to think off the top of my head, and it doesn't come in your starter kit, so I may end up making this a prize or something, but regardless, you want to get this in your first order because this is another thing that you will demo at every single appointment, okay? So this is my supplement bag. 
boom, right here. And then the last pouch, I keep the um, side hand set. Right now I have the pomegranate. I think I have one left. I'll probably be exchanging this out soon and just putting the white tea and citrus. But I always keep a um, fragrance-free hand cream too, just in case somebody's sensitive. Um, but also the satin lip set is in here. So this is my satin set. All right, and that is everything that I demo on a first appointment, except for the few color items, which I'll go over in a second. We'll, we'll go over a little bit later, but this is how I have it set up, you guys, and it's super great, super easy. It's part of my clothes. It's part of the table clothes. Okay, you have it all together. You have the cute little roll-up bag to kind of show um, because we have sets that include the roll-up bag, and so that's a really great thing to have and to just do it that way, and it can fit into your bag, and so that's what you want to have together. The other things that we demo in terms of color is your mascara, which you have in your starter kit, um, cream eyeshadow. So in your first order, 600 or higher, I always recommend getting the cream eyeshadows. There's six colors because we do a little dash out the door look, okay? So cream eye color, mascara, and then a lip color. So usually there is another, yes, Joy, the spa treatments are demoed on the first appointment. Those three, not all three of them, they get to pick one, okay? So they get to pick one spa experience. This is sort of the hook to book as well um, because it's different than what they may have ever had before with Mary Kay because we have so many fantastic spa treatments now that this is what we're offering. That we have a, I have another video that you guys will eventually watch if you haven't already to set up how to do a Google form for your pre-profiling, okay? Because one of the things that I now do is every single person I get in front of, they have filled up that form before I meet with them. So before, I used to always try and get a hold of everybody or try to get the guest list from the hostess, and that can be difficult. People don't always want to give out names and numbers. Um, people don't know who you are. They don't want to give information. But for whatever reason, you give a form, they fill anything out on that form. They have no problem filling out a form. It's bizarre, actually, but it's, it's what happens. So, um, so on that form, one of the things I say to them is, can you fill out this profile for me and select your spa treatment? And they're like, ooh, spa treatment. And that's why I do this, okay? So they only get to pick one of those three to do, but they get to pick it. It's their choice to pick it. And that's why I need each person that's coming to fill that out because then that way they get to pick it out. I don't want them to miss out on picking out their spa treatment, right? Okay. So profile cards then consequently are almost always filled out because because you have their information. So when I do the, the profile, pre-profiling, um, on my Google form, I get their name, I have the date of their appointment, um, I have their email, their phone number, um, and then I ask a few questions, not all of the questions, a few, like I wanna know their age range, I wanna know their skin, skin type, is it oily, combination, acne prone, dry, what is it? Um, I wanna know, um, if they could change one thing, what would it be? So it's kind of like their hot button on, on terms of skin. And, um, and I want to know their eye color. And the reason why I picked their eye color is because I make up little swag bags, which is another reason why they want to fill that out so I can customize their swag bag, which is a little gift. Okay. So that's all on another video um, on how to do that. And I literally walk you through. And the reason why I make videos is because you can pause, do your thing, watch some more, do your thing, and you can actually create it right alongside. And it's, it's easy peasy. Okay, so you wanna have these pre-profile. Um, occasionally you might have the person that didn't fill it out or whatever, but they can fill one out at the last second. But when you have these things pre-profiled, your customer's profile, it makes your life so much easier because A, you know what product to bring to the party. You, know, you can already kind of start setting them up. Um, you kind of have an idea of the age range that you're using because if I have all 50 and above, I'm probably going to demo the repair set, not the 3D, okay? Now, if you don't have that set, you're not even offering it. It doesn't matter if they're 85 years old. You're going you're gonna to demo the 3D. It's fine. It's a great skincare set. Um, but when you have the other options, that's probably the, where you'll go, okay? Unless it's somebody that uses soap and water, which means they're not used to spending any money on their skincare, which means I'll probably start them with the 3D, okay? So you just have to use some common sense there. Um, okay. So that's the print profile card. So you want to have one of those. So if you don't have it filled out, you definitely want to have a blank one there for them to fill out. So you want to have pens as well for them. Um, and just so, because you guys are new, um, if you're wondering, you know, gosh, how does she know what to put on me? Or 
how does she know what products will be good for what things? <clears throat> I am sorry. I have got like a dry throat right now. When they fill this out, or you fill it out for them when you're not, this is all the answers. This is the cheat sheet right here that tells you what kind of skin care they might need or want. Okay, so you don't have to know anything. <laughs> it's really great. Um, okay. All right, you're also gonna to wanna to have a sales ticket for every person. And again, I'm just gonna assume that nobody knows how to do this. So this is what the sales ticket looks like. Now, um, you wanna have their name on here, the phone or the date. Um, if it's a hostess and she has friends, you can put her suit, you can put her name there at the hostess so that way you can kind of group the, the, the sales tickets together. Um, if you have the profile part on them, I don't necessarily make them fill out everything again because I already have it on the card, but you've got to have it one or the other. And then you're going to fill this out. Now this is for you and you want to make sure you're filling this out well enough that you are able to put it into your app so that it removes the product from your shelf. So if you just put, you know, matte foundation and you don't put the color, you're not going to know what color it was that you needed to pull off your shelf. Okay. So it's not just a matter of giving them a total. It's also a matter for you to put it into your app so that you can actually pull that exact item off. Okay, does that make sense? So, um, so you're gonna put everything in. Subtotal is here, so you just add it up. Um, and then if you're, like sometimes I have this sparkle card, so that's $15 off. So anything, I do like a little bracket minus 15. I'll put SC for sparkle card, and that's the new subtotal. The new subtotal is now what I'm gonna tax. So if you're here in Brevard County, it's seven and a half percent. Wait, seven and a half, seven. Seven percent, is it seven and a half? Seven, seven 7%. Why did I just think seven and a half? I feel like all of a sudden it may have gone up. It's 7%, right? Troy? Yes? Okay. Um, so 7%, I don't know why I just went blank on that. And then you're gonna just add that total up, okay? And then that's what your total, your customer's gonna give you. So this is what you do. You don't give them the top copy, you give them the customer copy. And there's several customer copies, just give them one and done. If they're doing um, a credit card, you can always write it out here. And you know, you always, when you're doing credit cards, if you're in the field and you don't have your app to run the ProPay, you always wanna make sure that you get their billing zip code. I do the three digit number just, in, just as well, but really you need the billing zip code. So just, I always say if they have their address, I say now is that your billing, is that your billing address? Because sometimes people have it billed someplace else, so you gotta have that billing zip code. Okay, I think that's I think that's all we gotta do on that. All right, now four goals. We have four goals at every single selling appointment that we do. The first goal is we're trying to sell sets. Okay, we want to sell sets, not just product, but actually sets. So we have four goals, and the reason why we have goals is so that we have something measurable. Okay, because it's an automatic assumption that everybody's having fun. So that, that is the automatic assumption. Of course, we're going to have fun. They're going to have fun. They're going to feel great. But our, the only way we can measure if we're getting better, if we're reaching our goals, is to, is to have something that's measurable. So the first one is, did you sell sets? The second one is to get referrals. So you want to make sure you do something, a referral game of some sort, that you're getting referrals. So you're meeting new people. The third thing is that you want to have new Booking. So you always want to book their second appointment, or if you've already had their second appointment, then you want to book them for a guest at a meeting or an event that we have. You want to keep booking them for the. You always want to have the next step in mind. So as long as I keep saying yes, you keep booking them. And then the fourth thing is to set up a career chat. Okay, so we're working full circle every single appointment, no matter what. And when you're new, you're going to learn how to do all of this at the same time, no matter what. It doesn't matter who it is. Your grandma doesn't matter. She could be 90 years. Still do all these steps so that you get in the good practice of doing all these steps. Okay. And, and sometimes you'll have a bear fruit and sometimes it won't, but you did the, you did the step, right? You did it. So we're going to talk about that. All right. Your flip chart, flip chart. You can put this together. Um, some people like to, I probably, this is mine. Okay. And, um, um, you could put these in page protectors so it comes down a little bit lower and you know and get it together but you can write on this this is your flip chart so the back side of things um, hang on so what presents and what the back side is this is where you can write certain notes or just ticket or um, post-it post notes 
and that kind of thing. But this flip chart will literally walk you through the appointment. So many people stress out about the body of the appointment, but the body part is the least important part of the whole appointment. Okay, it's the least important most it's the least important part of the four goals because there's nothing about the body <laughs> in those goals. Um, so the very first thing I when they arrive, my table's set already. Most I already have their their um, profile cards pretty much filled out. Now when they arrive, they're not all filled out, so they gotta finish filling it out, right? So they're doing that, and I'm putting the final touches on their squirting of their, of their products and whatnot. Um, and then I ask everybody to take off their rings because I'm going to do satin hands treatment. So I do satin hands treatment kind of before I even really sit down and actually open up the party, okay? We kind of do that. It's a nice little icebreaker. Their hands feel great. Now they're clean to work on their face. So when I do the satin hands, I do, every, I do the first two steps, but not the third step. The third step is the hand cream. I wait till the end of the party to do that because I don't want them to have a hand cream on their hands before we do that, okay? Um, so in this flip chart, um, it, you know, literally, I'm not gonna go through the flip chart because you, you all know how to read, okay? So you can do the flip chart. It talks about a couple important parts. Um, all right, and you get to this one called the I story. Now, some of you guys have already finished MKU and some of you haven't. But in MKU, Mary Kay University, online, on InTouch, it's where you're going to get your Be Illusion necklace when you complete it, there is a lesson on the I story. The I story in Mary Kay is kind of like your testimony or whatever. It's, it's, it's kind of like a mini testimony. So it's like what I did prior to Mary Kay, um, why I joined Mary Kay, and what I'm working on for the future with my business, why I joined it, what I'm working on. Okay, so if you don't tell people that you're working on a cruise, you're missing the boat. You didn't tell everybody about that cruise. <laughs> so, but, but for whatever reason, you came into Mary Kay. It helps you, it helps you create your I story. And women want to help women, you guys. We, we want to help women. We want to, we, it is so exciting and motivating to see a woman be all in in her business and openly share what she's working on and what she's going for. That's attractive, you guys. People want to go, yeah, I don't know how she's going to do it, but I like that. I'm going to totally help her. Right? We, we're like that. We just want to. When people are like, you know, if you're like, yeah, I'm, I'm just going to see how this goes. And, uh, you know, if, if anybody wants to buy anything great, you know, then I'll make, might stick around a little bit. But th that's not motivating. Who wants to buy from something like that? Right? That's why having product on hand also shows your customers that you're serious about your business because you invested in your business and you're, you're serious. Right? So these are some of the things that are sub subconsciously going on. So you've got to be, even if you have no idea how you're going to get that cruise, you got to speak it, right? Because the more you speak it, your, your mind hears your own voice more than it hears anything else. And then other women are hearing you too. And they're like, oh, that's awesome. She's, I'm going to totally help her to get that cruise, right? Or whatever your goal is. Okay. So the I story is something that you don't really want to fluff over. And this has got blanks and stuff that you can fill, that you can fill out on here or you can, you know, paste a piece of paper on here if you don't want to do that you know, and, and have it so they can, you know, chart, you know, it says here, I've been in building my business for three days, whatever it is. My mission is to blank. My vision is to, and one of my goals is to, so you just simple, easy, but you know, it's very important. Okay. So keep reading the flip chart. We've done the satin hands. Everybody's sitting at my awesome table now. It looks amazing. And what I do you guys with those supplements, the three spa treatments. I want these little mirrors that you can get at the dollar store. And I, I grouped the three of them, microderm, charcoal mask, facial peel. I put them all in one mirror. What, and it doesn't matter, like I might have all three people in front of me doing charcoal mask. I still put the other ones out because I'm gonna talk about them so that they, if they wanna do it on their next appointment, they can. I have the miracle set set up. You know, I have the satin hands and satin lips on another little mirror and it's out so they can see what we're doing. I can point to it. All right, so first step, we're going through the flip chart, you're doing a cleanser. Everybody cleanses their face. Now I will tell you that the facial cleansing cloths that come in your, your kit, those are great. You can use those, or if you decide to get some washcloths, whatever, if you have access to a microwave, wherever you're doing your party, that's a really nice treatment to like warm up those facial cloths or warm up a washcloth for them to put on their face. It, it adds a little extra something something. Um, to it, which is really, really nice. Um, the other thing too is if you did get product, uh, I always make sure you get at least one skin invigorate brush and several 
boxes of the brush heads because I want you to demo the Skinvigorate brush because it's so great. And I love that thing so much, but me loving it wasn't selling it enough um, because I think people, I think I just love it. And I'm like, you know what? You just have to try it. So what I do is I have a little bowl of water. I know if it's, you know, four people, I have two bowls of water. I have one brush head. And then I have, all, I mean, one brush handle, and then I have a head for every single person, okay? So I just put a clean head on top of the little white um, facial cloth, and I talk about the Skin Big Right brush. I usually let the hostess start. She puts the head on, she puts it in the water, she does her, her um, cleanser on her face, pulls the head off, passes the wand, and the next one does it. She puts her head on, puts it in the water, does it. And when they put it in the water, it's clean. There's nothing on the head when they put it in the water, so the water's clean, stays clean. And by them trying it, first of all, you got you to gotta say, sometimes you have to say, okay, 30 second limit because they just want it, they'll just do it forever. It's like, oh my God, this feels so good. They're just like, okay, but they love it. They love it. Even the ones that have clear sonic love it. And then they want it at the end. Okay. So you definitely, definitely, definitely want to do that. All right. And, um, so when they're done with their cleanser, now their faces are all nice and clean. If you have that app and you want to offer the, um, the skin site skin analysis, you could, or you could just do it for the hostess. And then the others might want to book their party so that they get theirs done. Okay, you always want to like leave some carrots out there for people for reasons to book their next appointment. And then now we're gonna go into treatments. Okay, so this first part of the, of the party can really take a long time because some of the treatments take a long time. So if anybody's doing charcoal mask, that's the first one we do because it's 20 minutes, 20 minutes on their face. So you can have them do their whole face. You can have them do just their nose. You can have them do half their face. You can do whatever you want to do. Okay, half the face is really good um, because then they can see a difference. Um, sometimes when I'm doing the brides, I let them do the whole face because it's, like it's like the beauty treatment for their bridal party. But you guys, half the face is really a great thing to do because they get to see the difference between the two sides and feel it. It's amazing. So um, they put that on. What I do is I pass around the tube and I say, this is a spa in a bottle. It smells like a spa in the bottle. It smells so good. I talk about the ingredients in it. I talk about what charcoal does. I usually have this picture um, and I can post it again in our, in our wave group. Um, if you guys wanna borrow it, you're welcome to. But this picture is, um, it's about a director in Mary Kay who got bit by something in the middle of the night and she put some on where she thought the center was and you can clearly see it was a spider bite. So I talk about how it draws toxins to it uh, out and so it helped her leg reduce down to like nothing the next day it was all gone. Um, but you can, you, whatever, if you have a testimony of your own, that kind of thing, pictures were really worth a thousand words. So it's really great. So because that takes 20 minutes, you kind of got to do a little tap dance thing. So this is a perfect time. Okay, what did I do with it? This is a perfect time to do your first um, marketing sheet, your marketing sheet, okay? Which I printed them out, so now I've got to find what I do with them. <laughs> it's here somewhere. Okay, here we go. Okay, so I posted these just, just tonight on our wave group. So this is what I call the Did You Know. I just want you to know, I do Did You Knows because I've done, when I first became a consultant, just did you notice we're out? This is what I used. And I, for those of you who don't know, I earned my car in the first three months of my business. I gold medaled five new team members in my very first month. And this is what I did. I made sure I did at least 30 faces that first month that I put the product on people's faces. I had a did you know that every single person did that was in front of me. I actually printed out 30 of them and I numbered them 30 down to one so that I knew how many more faces I still needed to do. So this did you know, I pass one out to everybody and I let them know, I say, hey, I'm gonna, since we've got some time to kill here, um, what I'm gonna do is give you a little, some fun fast facts about Mary Kay, maybe you knew, maybe you didn't, but it's a did you know sheet and we're gonna go through it. So I said, just put your name at the bottom, I'm your consultant, so I know me, so you don't have to put my name, um, and then the, today's date and the phone number. Okay, and I said, I'm gonna read through each one. You just circle yes or no, did you know this? And I just kind of go through it. You know, did you know that Mary Kay products have the Good Housekeeping seal of approval and are recommended by Skin Cancer Foundation? Did you know? Yes or no? Um, and I go through, through all of it. When I get to the next portion, these are some of the reasons why many women choose Mary Kay. Which ones might be important to you? You can choose as many as you want. 
So I talk about, you know, the company philosophy of God first, family second, career third. You know, this is, this is something that's kind of important to me because um, I was teaching Bible studies at the same time. And I love the fact that I don't have to take off my Christian hat and put on a different secular hat. I can, I can talk about whatever I want. And these are the priorities. Mary Kay always believed that if you worked and lived in these priorities, you really could have it all. Um, extra money. I don't know about you, but I don't know too many people who couldn't use some extra money. So that was always a really great thing. There's prizes, awards, recognition, and earn the use of a free car. I actually earned my first one in the first three months. I've had 12 free cars since in the last 20 years. You know, you can throw in my stats. You can throw in your stats. Whatever you want to do. That's why we listen to so many people's eye stories because you can talk about those people and what they've earned and what they, if you haven't done this yet. Do you know what I'm saying? So it's really, really great. Um, to be your own boss. This was a really big one for me. Um, there's no ceilings in Mary Kay. Mary Kay has always said the highest paycheck has yet to still be earned. There are literally uh, um, records being broken every single day, and um, and we don't have ceilings. You don't have to wait for somebody to die to be promoted. You don't have to wait for somebody to quit to, or fire to be promoted. You literally can promote yourself as fast as you want, and there are no ceilings. That was important to me. And then flexibility is so another one I always talk about, personal time and family time. I said, you know, when I started my business, my youngest was three, five, and six. Those are my three children. That's the ages that they were. Now they're, you know, 23, my son's birthday is today, 26 and 27. And then I have two bonus children, 30 and um, 25. So when they got into college, I was like, yes, I'm going to rock and roll my business now. I'm going to get the Cadillac. I'm going to do all these things. And then my father got ill. And he got Alzheimer's. And then all of a sudden, I was a caretaker for him. And, and, um, and I was so grateful and thankful that I had this job, that I could actually spend time with him and do all the things I needed to do with him so that his last couple of years were as, as, as good as they could possibly be. And we actually earned our first Cadillac three days after he passed. So in doing all that, I had that flexibility. So I talk about that personal story because that's what happened to me, OK? so. Um, there are certain things that will be identifiable to you that you'll bring out your own personal story. And while you're doing this, did you know? Does that make sense? Um, then there's improved self-esteem and confidence. And then the tax advantages. And I will say, this year again, the tax advantages, I cannot stress enough. If you do not have an accountant that knows how to do Mary Kay, you need to find the accountant that knows how to do Mary Kay. And I have, I mean, I'm using Tiernan now. He is phenomenal. I, we really thought we were going to be paying a lot this year because my husband took early retirement and we actually get money back. It's a miracle. I don't even know, but thank the Lord Jesus for Mary Kay and my business. And my husband now is self-employed as well. And it's just so great. So then it talks about six qualities. I'm going through a lot on this, you guys, because this is important. Remember we talked about full circle? We're just hearing some fun, fast facts about Mary Kay, right? You're going to do a drawing with these, all of these, you yourself, not me, you, for $25 in free product. At the end of the month, actually, you'll probably do it on the first or second of the next month. You, this is when you say to them, this is when I say to them, do, does everybody have Facebook? If you have Facebook, let me know. I'm going to add you to my private group because I do a Facebook Live on my business page. And I do it on my business page, not my private group, because then I can put the post. I can post. I do it on my business page because you can take that video and share it anywhere. But if you do a video on your private page, it's not shareable. You can't. Nobody can watch it unless they're part of your private group, okay? So, but your business page, you can do stuff like this, not on your home wall, but your business page. So I let them know, I say, I'm gonna do a drawing. So let's make sure we friend each other so I can add you or so you can like my page. And then, um, and then you can watch and see if you're the winner. And you get $25 of free product, whatever you want. So the next section is six qualities of things of, um, we find in successful consultants. How many of them sound like you? I go through those, busy women, um, don't know a lot of people, family focus, financial, and I go through the reasons why those are. And then some critical questions to ask yourself. I missed nothing. I skipped nothing on this. You just rotely go through it. It's not emotional. You're just doing it. You're going to do a drawing at the end. Some critical questions to ask yourself. Am I being paid what I'm really worth? Do I have all the flexibility in my life that I want? Um, is my current career what I want to do the rest of my life? And do I have complete control over my career advancement? Those questions, yes or no. And then on a scale of 1 to 10, number one, I would never consider a Mary Kay business. I would rather eat dirt. Number Five is no fives. You can't, you have to pick one side or the other of the five, no number five. And 10 is yes, I'm in, the sky is the limit, I'm all about it. So just write down your number, it has to be any, you have to have a number to be in the drawing, any number will do, except for five, put a number down, and then you go around and collect them. How many of you guys can do that? Raise your hand. Not hard, right? Not hard, not, 
please do Mary Kay. You're just sharing some fun fast facts and some cool things about it. That's it. Boom, done. Now you've shared the marketing and you've shared it near the front of the appointment and you had to share it there because you have to tap dance for 20 minutes because you've got people with a charcoal mask on their face. All right. So now at this point, we've, we've eaten up some minutes, right? And uh, so the next longest treatment is the facial peel. So who at your party is doing a facial peel? There might not be anybody at your party doing a facial peel. There might not be anybody doing a charcoal mask. Then you start with a facial peel, but you're still going to do this because that's 10 minutes. The facial peel takes 10 minutes, okay? So you still do this. This is a great time to do this part. So then you're gonna talk about the facial peel. You're gonna pass it around. You can let them smell it. It's a soft scent. I wouldn't let them, it's too expensive to let them squirt out. It's 65, um, but you pass it around and those who are doing it, they will do half their face because you want them to see a difference, okay? You're gonna talk about the stats of it. You're gonna talk about the, the, the ingredient, not, well, the, the how it works. You're gonna talk about those things, okay? And um, and then you raise your hand, those who are doing the microdermabrasion. Now, when you are doing this, I'm talking to new consultants, so you may not have the facial pills. So that's not one you're going to offer. They get to pick charcoal or micro, okay? You got to figure out as you get the products what you're going to offer, right? Um, so microdermabrasion, again, half the face. No, 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 no. Microdermabrasion, you only demo on a tiny part of their face. So I always tell them they can pick one cheek, they can pick a forehead, they can pick a nose, they can pick a chin, but they can't do like a whole big area. And I said, the reason why is it's micro fine and you will have a very hard time without a shower getting it all off. Okay. And we don't have any of it on your face when we go to do the next steps. So just pick one little area and then you walk them through how to do that. And that's an immediate gratification. You again, talk about the things, let everybody see it, talk about it. Um, and then when they go to do step two of the microdermabrasion, that's when I let them do half of the face because that stays on. That's going to be done twice a day. Every day it stays on and they get to keep it on their face. So they cleanse their whole face and then everything else is kind of half face. Okay. Or let or smaller. Whew, I'm exhausted. I feel like I've been talking a ton. Okay. I got more to do. We got a lot more to do. Okay. So now you're going to go into the rest of the 3D, okay, and it goes very quickly because it's just day cream. I don't even I don't even squirt the night cream anymore. I used to squirt the night cream, but you really don't need to. They don't. I mean, they don't need to. They don't need to. They're not going to put it on their face. So um, the day cream, really important to note. My husband must be printing something. So it's really important to note that the day cream you just need a tiny bit. Okay, it's someone when you squirt it, a lot of times you squirt more than they need. I just have them dip their finger and tap, tap, tap only on half their face, not the other half. Tap, 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 and then rub it, rub it in so they can see how far it goes. They can always add more, but um, Thank you. Um, they can always add more, but you don't have to have too much. And that's the thing about this product, is it's such a little amount, is all you need, which is another sun. But she can stay in here, it's okay. Um, so that's another really great selling point about it. But again, let them do just the same half of their face because at the end of this, they're going to be amazed at how great their skin feels on the one side compared to the other. Okay. So the day cream only, and you're going to follow along in the flip chart. You'll talk about the night cream, but you just tell them you don't use them both at the same time. One, it's a 24 hour system, so you don't need both, but you can talk about it. Okay. Um, now, they're, they're done with that. So then I asked, how many of y'all have ever tried foundation primer? Oh, backing up. Sorry. Let's back up for a second. When they have the treatments and you've done the facial peel and you're like, you want to kill a little few minutes, satin lips is a great time to do satin lips then. Okay. So you can do it then. You can put satin lips whatever, but that's a really great time to do it then just to kind of kill a few more minutes. And everybody loves satin lips. It's a perfect time to do that. Okay. So um, when you have people doing the charcoal mask too, if you are using washcloths, you want to make sure that people that are doing the charcoal mask use one of those disposable facial cloths first to get the majority of it off. Um, and or you want to have like gray type washcloths because the charcoal mask will stain and make your pink or white washcloths dingy looking if you, if you use those and let them take it all off with that. So the disposable ones are great to take the majority of it off. Um, that way you can throw those away because it's so messy. Um, so yeah. Okay. So that was that. Um, Okay, I got my notes to keep me on track. Did you know, $25 product drawing. So 
So we're going to finish up the 3D. Now we're at foundation primer. So done the set notes. Now we're at foundation primer. Foundation primer, again, why do we prime a wall? The same things, you know, learn about that little bit of a product. It's probably in here too. Um, and again, half the face, the same half of the face. Don't let them do it on the other side because I think probably the majority of people that I, I meet with have never tried foundation primer. Maybe like 60% never have and 40% have. And the ones that have it always want to know, oh my gosh, what brand do you use? And a lot of times it's Smashbox. And then I always say, okay, well, let me know what you think about this one and how it compares to Smashbox because I'm always interested in knowing. And I've yet to have anybody tell me that ours was not as good as whatever they're trying. Often it's better than whatever they're trying. And Smashbox, you guys, I think is $45. So then I tell them, oh, oh my gosh, wow. I'm like, okay, well, ours is, was it 16, 16 or 18? I think it's 18. I say, well, ours is 18. And they're like, oh my God. You're like, you know, they just can't believe it. Okay. So um, that's a really fun thing to do. Um, okay. So foundation primer, half of it. All right. And now um, we're going to talk about the foundations, but we're going to let them do CC cream because that's what you have in your kit. And our new foundations are coming out later. We're going to do a huge thing on training for that um, in May, but that's not now. They don't need to know about that now. So now you're going to go into the CC cream, which is so great and so easy because there's five shades for the whole human race. It is literally difficult to get the wrong shade. So they're either super ivory, which is very light. Okay. They're either light, dark ivory or light beige, which is light to medium. Then they're like medium beige. Good solid beige is medium to deep. Then you've got your, your kind of really dark, dark beige, light, light bronze is the deep. And then the dark bronze is the bronze. Or the, is the very deep okay really easy and it's in it and it totally um it's it's sheer so you blend it blend it all right and you talk about all the great things about it how it's got redness reducers how it's got spf in it another layer of spf you talk about that with foundation primer too you know you talk about the redness reducers the age the skin brighteners the age um fighting ingredients you talk about those things and you let everybody put it on Again, with this, dab, 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 and, and blend it out because it, it's not foundation where they're going to try to place it. A lot of people try to do that and they get way too much on. So you got to like teach it. It's like lotion. You're like literally rubbing it out. And I always have them do it with their hands because I feel like that does need to be rubbed in versus the foundation brush. Okay. Now, at this point, I have the five CC, or the five, no, six um, cream eyeshadows. Okay. And I let everybody see the lookbook and I go to the page where it's at and I, and I tell everybody, okay, so now we're gonna just do a quick dash at the door look. And so you're not leaving naked. So did you guys notice that foundation primer was on half the face, but CC cream was on all of the face? We're not gonna make them leave out like Corilla DeVille. It's, you know, they get to cover the whole face. But this is a really good time. Let me stop right here. Good time for you guys. Do you see a difference? Did you see how much you used on the one side compared to the other side? Was there, did you feel any difference? How does it feel? especially when they're doing the um, spot treatments too. Make sure you see how you talk about how does it feel, okay? And then I show them the cream eyeshadows. I said, well, you get to pick one, which one would you like to do? This is like a sheer color wash on your eyes. Just a little something, something with a little mascara in order to pick out a lip color and you guys will be good to go. Okay, so we do that. They pick it out, you use a spatula to put it on. Um, and then they, I like to give the demo cream concealer eyeshadow um, brushes to use. If you don't have that, they can use their finger. They could use a sponge tip, but a sponge tip does absorb a lot of it. Um, and you can go with that. And then a little mascara, which you have in your kit. And then the lips. So, you know, eventually you're gonna wanna get the lip case, which is, which is a prize. When you do your power start, you'll get the whole lipstick case from me. Um, but, you know, I think there's lip gloss samples and things in your kit, but get a couple of lipsticks too, just things that you like and start building your demos and let them pick a lip, okay? So you do a little lip and now you're done, okay? So now we do some, how do you look? How do you look? How do you look? La, 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 you know, like compliment time. So-and-so, what's the best thing you like about so-and-so? And it's weird because people don't like to receive compliments. It's like, we love to give them, but we hate to receive them. But it still makes you feel really good when your friends are saying, oh my God, that lips look, looks so good. Your skin looks is glowing or whatever, you know? Uh, so it's really important to do. It's part of the flip chart. Okay, the referral game. The referral game is in the flip chart as well. Um, Got to find it. Hang on. And I would put tabs, personally, you guys. 
I would put tabs on this so you can like flip to things easily. Um, so they call it the beauty of friendship referral activity. You can do this one exactly like it is. Um, or we do the, um, actually Michelle Cunningham came up with this and I just love it. We've been doing it for a long time. So this is a sheet that I also posted on, on um, our Facebook web page. I put it, it used to be a whole sheet, but I made it into two so you could, you know, have two to a page. So you can do this. Or you can have them, if you don't want to print out a separate piece of paper, you can have them do referrals in the back of the profile card right here, okay? So you can do this a lot of different ways. This is something that um, is one of those things that you say the greatest compliment you can give me is the gift of referrals. Or you can do this beauty of friendship thing, which is really great as well. Um, but what I usually do is the sparkle cards that you have that, I get, that everybody gets in my unit. Um, so a lot of times you can give everybody a sparkle card that completes this whole thing. You could give out tickets for everybody who gives all, all a whole sheet of names. You do like a contest who's the fastest, but you always ask them, you say, okay, so what I'm looking for are people that are nice like you over the age of 18 that, you know, live within a certain radius. So in town, in state, whatever, you know, I always say like usually two hours, I'm having to drive two hours, um, you know, but they have to be nice like you guys, you know. Um, it doesn't matter if they're wearing makeup wearers or not, because if you notice, you, you have just a dash off the door, like the, the most of everything we just did today was skincare. So it's just really people that are looking for, that you would like to pamper the gift of friendship, um, give something that's overworked or, or um, you know, that you think would just really enjoy having a free makeover, or maybe they would like to be in the contest that we're doing with the designer handbag, you know, that kind of thing. So you just, you just share like that. And you say, okay, who's competitive? Get your phones out. You guys get to use your phones for this. Okay. And so all I need is their first name and their phone number. And if they like to text or if I need to call them, either way, it's, it's written right here, text or call. Make sure that they put their name at the bottom. And so what I always do is I give one ticket for every five names they give me, okay, for the drawing, whatever I'm drawing for. I give one ticket for every five names. I give um, the person that finishes the whole sheet automatically gets a, it's a, gets a gift. So that gift could be the sparkle card for $15 off their order tonight or $15 off a purchase of $50. It could be that. You could have some eyeshadows that you want to give out. It could be like a little sample of, um, you know, like the little sample tubes of the oil for makeup paper. It could be whatever you want to be. You can give that, okay? And um, this is how we get our referrals, all right? So this is really critical. And you might get four names here, but you'll get somebody that does a whole sheet. You might get everybody that does a whole sheet. Super competitive. They're out there writing it out, writing it, writing, writing. This is how you, you'll end up avoiding having to go out and warm chatter if that's something that is not your favorite thing to do. Okay? This is a skill. You will get better at it. But don't be afraid because it is fun. I play music on my phone, and I, and I let people um, go at it. They just go, go to it. And, you know, sometimes it's, you know, if you see people kind of hesitating, they're not really sure. I'm like, listen, guys, you know, if you have family members, if you have, if you go to church, you know, if you have people that co-workers, people that you think might, whatever, you kind of jog their, their minds a little bit. But a lot of times they're just, they're just writing it out. And you just say, I'm just going to send them one text just to see if they um, would like to have a food makeover, just like you're having. Boom, done. Table clothes. Okay. You know what always said? A class worth booking is a class worth coaching. And if you don't do a table close, you're not letting people know how they can get the product. So I always used to be weird. My very first um, party, or first, first facial actually, um, the lady had to beg me to buy the product because I was so worried about being pushy. I was so worried that she would think I was pushy that I was literally fighting with her almost because she wanted to buy the product. And I was like, no, 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 you don't have to buy anything. I promise you don't have to buy anything. I told you you didn't have to buy anything. She's like, no, but I really like it. Do you have it? I go, well, I do have it, but you don't have to buy anything. And she's like, well, if you're not going to sell it to me, I'm going to get it from somebody else. I'm like, okay, 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 I'll get it for you. That's how silly I was, okay? So when you do these appointments, the idea is that they are going to feel pampered and they're going to feel great. And I never want to sell something to somebody that they don't need or want, okay? I never want to do that. But you have to let people know how they can get it because only they know if they want it or not. You can't assume or judge, prejudge anybody. You can't assume she has no money and therefore I'm not going to tell her how to get it. No, 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 no. That's not right for you to do. We don't prejudge people. You have to at least let people know how they can get it, okay? And Mary Kay is free. People can get it for free, okay? So you have to share all that with them and let them make the decision for them. Does that make sense? So the table close is done after the referral game. This is the placemat that comes in your starter kit. Enjoy 
B, actually I can't even say Joy B, I can say Joy Badarak. Remember how you had the color, I gave you the color placemats and you're like, I got these in my kit. Well, I was with Dela and I noticed they both come in the kit now, which they didn't before. So what I'm gonna do for that specific um, prize, instead of giving you a set of color ones, I'm gonna give you two color and two skincare. Now you will have a set of six and for both appointments. Does that sound good? So you're, you know, you have six mirrors and trays and now you have six placemats. I'll give you two skincare and two color to add to the four that you already have in your kit and we're good. So this is what's presenting to them when they have their mirror and trays on front. So I clean everything up quickly, okay? And then I have them turn their placemats over, all right? And at this point, I start with this set, the ultimate. And I let them know that this is everything pretty much that they tried today. So it's the full 3D Miracle set plus the microdermabrasion, but this microdermabrasion could be replaced with the facial peel or it could be replaced with the Skin Vigorate brush. Um, so either way, it could be replaced with either one of those. Um, and then you get a free foundation and you get a half price set down here. Okay, so not the skincare set and not the skincare set, but you get a half price. So this is what we tried. We tried the satin hands, we tried the satin lips, here's the Skin Vigorate brush. Um, this is like the on the go set that we just did. And then these are the other skincare sets. So they can't get a half price one of those, but they could get a half price roll-up bag. Do you see how cool this is? Those are exactly, this is everything we tried today. Pretty cool, huh? So that is what you get with the ultimate, ultimate miracle set. With the miracle set, purchase of a miracle set, you get a half, you get a um, free foundation. And the purchase of a basic set, you get a half price foundation. Okay? So this is one way, this is how you can close this party with the table closed. All right, so another thing that I put into the Facebook great wave group is our three question close sheet. All right, so this is something that you can print out. So at the table, you go through, and I always hold up, this is the miracle set, it comes with the day, it comes with the cleanser, the day cream, the night cream, and the eye cream. Oh, I forgot to do the eye cream, you guys. We do the eye cream in the set too, that's after the day cream, sorry. See, I'm not doing it actually in front of you, but you get it. So I tell everybody we do the, um, so I, I point out each one of the things that, that they can have. And I usually have it in my roll-up bag because that's one of the things that they can get as one of their half price items, okay? And so um, these are the three question clothes. So I tell them to turn over, their, turn over their profile card and in this solid pink area, I have them write the numbers one, two, and three. I say, does anybody have any questions? And, um, answer any questions that they might have. And then I say, okay, well, I have some questions for you. So just turn this over, go to the, the pink area, write number one, two, and three. And I say to them, if money were no object, if you could have anything you want, what would be the set you would want to go home with today? Um, so one of the things I want to tell you guys really quick is I have other closing sheets that I've done for years. And um, what's cool about that other one that I do is this, the closing sets are on one side and on the other side is the picture of the starter kit. So um, I think that I would go through these sets, but I think I would have a starter kit flyer as well. And I would explain these sets, starting with the ultimate, the miracle, the basic, and then I would tell them about the one more set that actually is a price point in between these two. And I would tell them about the starter kit set and I would have the picture of everything in the starter kit set. And I'll explain how it comes with both formulas, full miracle sets, both formulas. It comes with a lot of the things that you try today, like the satin hand set, um, which is right here. Satin hand set, it comes with a, a mascara, um, a translucent powder, everything. And I always ask them, say, so how much do you think that set would be? And usually they're saying like a couple hundred dollars at least. Um, and then I show them the set and I said, well, it's actually $100 plus tax and shipping. I said, but you also get a business. You get incredible training. My director is amazing. Go ahead and say that about me because I'm amazing. I'm just kidding. But, but you get, you know, you don't have to figure it out on your own. You're literally walked through every step, whatever you want. There's no quotas. There's no territories. And you can have a really great business making some side money or a lot of money. I have a whole career, whatever you want. So I let people know where that, self, where that set falls into. Okay, so I have that other picture. This is a little different than what I've done for so many years. But this, there's no reason for you to print out another closing sheet when this is this is the sets that we use. So that's why I'm kind of converting this. So 
If money were no object, what set would you want to go home with? This is question number one. Would you want to go home with the Ultimate Miracle Set, the TimeWise 3D Miracle Set, the Basic Set, or the Starter Kit Set? Okay, let them write it. Um, question number two. At your second appointment, which you've talked about all throughout the party, I just didn't go through the whole party. At your second appointment, you get to pick between one or two things. One, it could be the glamour appointment, which will be do advanced glamour, we do triple primers, we'll do three eyeshadows, cheek, um, contouring, we can do contouring, um, lip liners, lips, the whole nine. Full glamour appointment. So you can learn some really cool tips and tricks with the glamour. So that would be your glamour appointment. Or you can do a deluxe spa, which is zero glamour, but you get to pick four spa treatments. And so this was just a sampling of the spa treatments that we have. We actually have vitamin C, serum plus C. We have vitamin C squares. We have a moisture renewal gel mask that you can pick from. And if you have six friends join you, you can actually try, you as a hostess can try the biocellulose mask, which is a coconut water mask. It's phenomenal. Um, and so, you know, we have a mint bliss for your feet. We have all these different treatments that you get to pick from, four of them. And so it's a total spa day, okay? So you let them, you describe it like that, all right? And so you just say, so question number two is, do you want deluxe spa or do you want glamour? So they write that down, okay? Um, and then this is a really great time, actually before this, but it's really great to kind of explain the hostess program that, that if they want to have that, they can, that appointment by themselves, they can, or they can have it free with three or more people, okay? So they get free stuff by sharing it with three or more people, all right? And that's where you talk about the hostess plan, which is another another subject okay um so one-on-one -on -one or three and free is what we always say so part a is spa or glam deluxe spa or glam second part is one-on-one -on -one or three and free all right and then the third question i have for you guys is and this is all written out so you can print this out um third question is you've heard a little bit about the business side of mary Kay. with all the information that you've heard tell me which best describes your interest a Absolutely sounds great. Sign me up. B, buy me a cup of coffee and tell me some more. I have a few questions. Or C, nope, I'm happy to be remaining remain a customer. Okay? So that's that. They fill that out. That's all done at the table as one big group. Now it's critical. I know it's nine o'clock. I'm almost done. But it's critical that after you do the group table close that you meet with one, each one of them individually. It's critical. I'm telling you, it's so critical, you can't even believe it. And you'll feel stupid because it's your friends. You'll feel like a weirdo, like it's like grandma, auntie, and mom, and you're going to tell them you're meeting with them one on one. But you have to do it because, A, it's, it's your skill that you're learning. Because when you're doing with people you don't know, and even if, even if it is people you know, not everybody wants to share their money situation. Not everybody wants to share that they have blackheads and want to know something get, you know, fixes that. Not everybody wants to share everything in front of all their friends, right? So um, you can see that this person wrote down these three things, okay, at this party. Um, so she wants the miracle set is what she wants to go home with. If I were no object, glamour is what she wants to have as her next appointment. And, um, and she put nice here because I used to do it everything. So anyway, you meet with them one-on-one. -on -one. At your individual closing area, you have your um, hostess packets. You have team building packets, which is another story, another training. You're gonna have your calendar. If it's in your phone, great, whatever. You're gonna have a lookbook there. These lookbooks, by the way, are not at anybody's place setting during the party at all. Nobody gets a lookbook at the party, during the party. This would be in your hostess packet. This would be, you could have a stack there. To, if they don't wanna have a party, you can give them one to go home with, but this does not, this is not presented at this table at all. Because what will happen is people will look through it and they will hunt, listen to you at all and they will pick one or two things out of here and not focus on the sets. That's why we do the sets and everything on here is exactly what you put on them that day, okay? You don't wanna give them an entire book of other stuff for them to look through because your sales will not be the same. And what they experience that day is what's here. Okay, so individual clothes. So you're gonna have your stuff together in another room or, or a separate area of the same room where you can kind of meet with them one-on-one, -on -one, and then you're going to have them bring their profile card, okay? And you're going to say, oh my gosh, I so how, did you have fun? You know, what was your favorite thing that you tried today? How's your skin feel? That's awesome, right? I think you look, and you give them a sincere compliment, and you say, okay, let me see here. Okay, so and I always check the front of the profile first to make sure I have their whole mailing address, their email, their phone number, their birthday, so you don't need a year, 
just this information, okay? Because sometimes they'll start to write and they forget to write it or they didn't finish it all or they didn't write their address because they don't know you. And in the beginning, they don't even know if they want to give you their address. But at the end, they love you. But they forgot to go back and write their address. So you want to make sure they fill that in, okay? So get that all done first. Then you say, okay, if money were no object, you want to go home with a miracle set. But I know that sometimes money is an object for people. So what do you want to go home with today? Because I have everything in stock. So what would you love? Okay, and then she tells you, and you write it up. And then, and then um, so she might say, no, I do want to go home with the miracle set. I'm like, great, awesome. Okay, so what foundation did you, want to, did you want? Did you like the CC cream that you tried, or did you want to try mineral powder? You didn't try it today, but, you know, you can get that instead if you want. And she'll be like, uh, no, I'll do, the, I'll do the CC cream. Okay, and that shade, you like that shade? Great. Okay, so did you, did you need anything else? No mascara, anything else at all? You just keep offering until they say, nope, that's good. When they finally say, nope, that's good, that's when you stop. Okay, because sometimes they forget. I, so I would have said, so how about the foundation primer? Did you want that as well? Or, because with the Miracle Set, you get, um, well, you get the full, you get a free, um, free foundation, but did you want the foundation primer? Because that's also, and she's like, oh yeah, I forgot about that. And she'll, you'll add that in. So you just keep doing that until they say, no, you know, that's good, okay? And then you close it. You close that sale all the way. You get the payment. You fill it all out. You're good. Okay, you let her know that you're gonna fill it, you'll get it for her in a second. And then you go to the next question. Okay, so your next appointment, you wanna have glamour. Okay, awesome. So I see here that you wanna have it with three and free. Great, because we've got some awesome stuff and I've got some great, great, great fun tips and things to share with your friends. So um, I have my day book right here. So my next two appointments that are available, did you need weekends or weekdays? Okay, so my next weekend appointment would be this, this day here. Is that good for you? Oh, I don't know. I need to check my friends. Okay, well, you know what? The most important people are you and me. That's good for me, and I do book up kind of quick. So if you want to, like, we can pencil that one in. You can talk to your friends. If you need to change it, you can. But why don't we just go ahead and put it on the books, and you can let me know tonight or tomorrow if we need to change it. Okay? That's how you do that. I said, because I always say, like, getting your girlfriends together, sometimes it's like herding cats. It's like we're all busy, got different things going on. It's going to be, like, really hard. So if we just get this on, then we know we can change it if we need to. But let's just pencil it in. Okay, then you have the hostess packet, you give it to her, all right? And then it says here um, that she is B, buy me a cup of coffee, I have questions. Okay, great. So do you off the top of your head know what questions you have? Because I've got a video I can send to you, but if you've got questions right now, I can answer those for you right now. Um, and then you kind of go through that, okay? So like Rachel's on here, she, she, she told me yesterday or whatever, she already knew she was signing up in the beginning of the party, I didn't know that, but... So I didn't like try to send her a video because she was ready to go. She was an A, absolutely, you know, I'm doing this. So you want to, you just, you know, so if somebody said, A, you don't say, okay, I'll send you a video. If they say, no, I want to sign up, then you sign them up, okay? Um, if they are a B or a C, you know, you just ask them, are there any questions that you have? That might be something silly. And you're like, oh, well, here's the answer to that. So are you still a B or now are you an A? You, you know, you just do, you don't have to move to the next step. But. If they are a B, or even if they're a C and you like them, go, you know what, I'm new, and uh, part of my training, I get to earn some jewelry, and you're really nice, I really love this about you, or whatever, would you be giving, willing to give me your honest opinion about the opportunity? It may not be for you at all, and I totally understand that you're not really interested. I said, but, but it helps me with my training. I actually have to share this business with a couple of people um, to earn my pearl earrings or my pearl bracelet, and um, I would really value your opinion. Um, all you have to do is watch a video. It's like 15 minutes long and then just do a three-way call with my director and I. And she's super cool. It's no, no pressure at all. It's absolutely just getting your opinion about it. And she'll give you a free mascara or a free lip gloss just for giving your opinion. And that's what, that comes from me. Okay. Or I'll buy them a cup of coffee either way. All right. So super easy. And then you have that in your phone, the link that you send to them. You text it to them right then. And you say to them, okay, so is tonight good to talk? We have time this afternoon to watch that or should we do it tomorrow morning? What's a good time for you? And you do it like within the next 24, at the most 48 hours, but within the next 24 hours, the career chat. The reason for that is people are much more likely to sign if they're remotely interested because it's the closest to the product. The sooner you try the product on somebody, that, that's how hot they are in order to sign up. Um, if you let way too much time go by, they forget how much they love that product, okay? That is a super strong correlation for that. All right, I think that's it. Do you guys have any questions? I really went through a lot, but you can watch the recording. <laughs> and of course, you want to at least watch three skincare parties, but you don't want to wait to hold your own appointment and observe one 
you want to jump into the frying pan and hold your own appointments, this flip chart literally walks you through everything. You cannot mess up. But I tell you, you will not know what you do not know till you hold your own first appointment. Then you'll go, oh my gosh, how did they transition from that to that? How did they do that? And then when you watch another, another observe another party, that's what you're looking for. Then you'll hold your next one, right? And then you're like, oh, Okay, I got that, but now how did she do this? I forget, I didn't watch that part, I forget what she did. So then you observe another one, and you, that's how you learn, okay? And you talk to your director every, after every party. All right, you guys. I'm gonna unmute you guys, just see if you have any questions. Unmute, unmute, unmute. You guys good? Good, good. Mm -hmm. No questions at all? So I either bored you to death, or you just, you're good. Can, can you repeat where you fold in comparing the miracle set with, or the ultimate with the business? When you talked about it's a hundred dollars here, but it's a hundred dollars here. Oh, you, okay, yeah, so, all right, so I'll go through, at the table close, I'll go through ultimate miracle set, the miracle set, the basic set, and then I'll have a picture, like like on my old one, I had it on the back, but this is this is different. So. I would have it printed out, and you can even laminate it, okay, so you can use it over and over again. Um, and I would say to them that, um, or there's another set price point in between the basic and the miracle. It's a different, it's a price point, so let me tell you about it. And, and it's, it's the starter kit set that comes with two of these, two miracle sets, one in the combination formula, one in the normal formula. It comes with five CC creams, all five shades, so you can match anybody's shade. It comes with a full-size satin handset. It comes with a full-size ultimate mascara. It comes with a full-size translucent powder. Um, it comes with a full-size oil-free eye makeup remover. It comes with a super cool bag. Show your bag. Super great bag. A really cute date book that's kind of the happy planner. Um, all your materials that you need for your business. Um, and and you can even say, my director always says, it's like the Mary Poppins bag, because she pops out and helps you too. Like, you're never gonna have to figure this out on your own. You will always have somebody to hold your hand. Um, we have no quotas or territories, so you can have a business. You can make some side extra money. You can have a career if you wanted it. You can have free cars. You know, you can say, my director's earned 12 free cars, you know, doing this business and raising her children. And, um, and so, you know, it can be anything you want or nothing at all. But I wanted to share that with you because it's a price point, how much, how much do you think all this would cost? And then I say, because it's $100. It's in between these two sets. And that's how I do that. That's okay, good. Thank so you. I share that here. And then when I do the three-question close, that's one of the sets that they could pick as the, if money were no object. Okay. And what did you call it again? You called it the? Starter kit set. Starter kit set. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. You know, because when somebody's thinking about becoming a, a consultant, there's, it's really just a hundred dollar decision. Do they want to become a consultant or not? Do they want to, do they want to spend a hundred dollars and have a, um, an opportunity to have a business and make extra money? The first decision is just a hundred dollar decision. And it's a hundred, and it really is that simple. It's not knowing, having to know how to do it all up front. It's a hundred dollar decision of which, oh, and by the way, this month, you need to let them know that they also get a $55 brush set, which would be good to have one on hand is to show them what that is. But that's the other thing that with this month, it's $55 on top of that. So you get $450 for $100. Okay. It's ridiculous. And then you can share with them, because like with Rachel's thing, I was explaining to her that, I was explaining to the whole table that, um, you know, because a couple of them were like you know, asking a lot of questions. So I said, well, listen, let me just tell you. It's $100 for the first one. So if Rachel wants to do it, it's $100 for her, but she can then add three team members for $75 each. And they all still get the brush set. And they were all like, what? So feel free to share that because that's the facts. That's the truth. Okay. Okay. That's a great question. Any other questions? All right, you guys, I'm sorry I went over, but there was a lot to do. But like, again, that was sort of the mechanics behind it. Um, and uh, so you guys can always watch back to play. And then I'll, if you go to the Facebook way page, I'll probably post it in the band as well. Those three, those three um, handouts, the three question clothes, the did you know, and you can print these at Office Depot in color, you know, for pennies, like really cheap. And I would print 30. If you're going to do power starts, do at least 30. So for each month, so you're not having to like go print more and more and more. And then also the fabulous furrow game, or you can use the back of the profile card. Either one works great. 
Okay? All right, y'all. Have a great night. Bye. Bye. Yeah.